just said, how do you train that parallel with when you're talking to your sales guys? The good news is, is they, I, I promoted all of them from within. So they, they were superhuman members before they became superhuman salespeople. So they're, their physiology is of excellence. These guys have made ridiculous transformations. And so their belief in the product is like, if, if it was one out of 10, it's a it's an 11, right? So yeah. they have that belief because they have that transformation. They're already doing the physiological stuff. And then, you know, these guys weren't sales pros before I had to train yeah. them into being good salespeople, right? And so one of my one of my very first things that, that I hit on every single week is the most transferable thing from me to you is my energy, right? So a lot of like, we, we can have a ton of objection overcomes and what to say if this happens. But at the, yeah. at the end of the day, that energy and that person is going to leave with this feeling that like, man, like, I, I don't know what it is or what that guy even said. But like, I vibe, I vibe with them, right? And so I'm always talking yeah. about that energy that they're bringing into this zoom call where a person's going to decide, you know, whether they want to spend 4000 10,000 or $60,000 with us. Um, and, and that's always number one, right? It's, it's that yeah. energy transference. I'm like, what energy, like what emotional state I should say, do you want that other person to feel when you leave the conversation? Right. And, yeah. and in order to embed that in you, I have to embed it into myself. So like, if I'm going to sell somebody before I, before I, you know, going to sell them and I don't sell anymore usually, but if I had to, I want that emotional state to be motivated to take action. Yeah. And so mm, I have to yeah. feel that motivated to take action or you're not going to feel it all. I, I have no chance with just words, no matter how great I am with words. So oh. first and foremost for me is always that I'm always speaking energetic state. And so if they're struggling, I'm like, what's going on in your life? Like what, like, are, is everything good at home? Like, um, how are you feeling? Because I want to know kind of where, where their life is like almost projecting the other type of person that's showing up on that other side.